Hey, how's it going everyone? Today I'll be showing you how to use the Flow Frames application to increase your frame rate using GIFs or video clips. All you have to do is click the link in the description, which will lead you to the following website. Once you're on the website, all you want to do is click on download now. If you, if you don't want to donate, all you have to do is click on no thanks. And you should be presented with a download. I want to click on download and it will download the Flow Frames installer for you. I'm not going to do that because I already have the application installed. This is what you're going to get. I'll double click it. Select your installation folder. Your GPU support auto detect. Same for all of those. You can choose to pre-install the models or not, depending on if you want to use it offline or not. Click on next here and it will download the application. I'm not going to do that because I already have it installed. So once you've done that, it's fully installed. It should have an option to automatically open it. If not, search up flow frames and it should be here. Now once we're in here, you're going to want to see, once we're in here, you're going to see all of these tabs. The only important ones for us are the interpolation and the preview. Now, please keep in mind, if you have a slower GPU, this will take longer, or you will have to sacrifice your resolution for frame rate. Some of these options we're all just going to leave the same. Input video, going to browse folder. I have a folder here called GIFs, I'm going to use that and you'll be able to browse videos after you have browsed your folder. To be using this walking psycho thingy and over here it will show you the current frame rate and the frame rate we would like to achieve. In this case, I'm going to leave it at two times, you can choose more. Over here you can change the speed. And as I said, we're going to leave this the same. The output mode is actually something we're going to want to change. Let's say you're exporting a video. It's going to be MP4. Um, depending on what you need. Honestly, I'm just going to do animated GIF because it is going to be a GIF. Um, so we're done with that. Quick settings, I just leave it as it is. In the preview, you can see the GIF. You're going to want to click on interpolate. Again, but once it's done, it should say it's done. And... That's about it. Over here in the folder, I'm pretty sure I've showed you guys the previews of this. This is what you can achieve. As you can see, this is an Amogus spinning at slow frame rate. And over here, we have the fast Amogus spinning. Much smoother on the duck, too. You can see there's a difference. That is it for the tutorial. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you'd like to see more please comment let me know if you run into any issues do let me know and if you enjoyed the video please be sure to leave a like and subscribe it really does help me that being said thank you for watching have a good day peace